Hey there, my loves. It is Wednesday, December 21st. Yes. Listen, time is flying. Christmas is swiftly approaching and I hardly did any kind of shopping for gifts. And I don't give gifts to too many people, but the few people that I give gifts to, I, I do need to get on it. <laughs> I think that some people may end up getting money because honestly, it's harder to shop now these days for like my nieces and stuff because they're grown and they already know what they want and I feel like they can do a better job at getting their own gifts in my opinion. Anyway, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Glomas. Um, thank you guys so much for all of your support so far and I see that you guys have actually been enjoying them. I know that it's a lot because they're coming rapid every day. One new video is up. I missed one day and I'm hoping to honestly upload two today, but I made plans for life, but life has other plans for me. So I will just take it in stride. I hope to at least upload a new one, at least one, but my praise to upload two of them. So I just, um, I just finished curling my hair i haven't worn this unit in a while this is the love me hair and i've had this for about a month or maybe two months and i wore it quite a bit for the first two weeks when i had received it but when i'm going to work getting this unit on my head and lay the edges the way i want to lay them takes some time and i would find myself getting to work late just because i'm fussing with this hair <laughs> So I would love to find out a way how I can just get these edges to lay and when I'm ready to put this wig on I just put it on my head make sure it's secure and be out there must be a way I might need to find someone who is good at like making ed the edges laid and just have the person be able to just put it on because I know that that's a, there's a way to do that anyway i can't really i can work out in it but to me it would be like it would be sweated out so that's one of the reasons why i take it off every day some people keep their wigs on once they either glue it on or whatever i can't do that because it's gonna come off anyhow i mean i can't imagine it staying on with all the sweating i do when i'm working out so i apply this wig every day so it's an installation that takes about 15 minutes or more and then i have to curl it if it needs to be curl at the ends and it just takes too much time in my mornings i usually only have about 45 minutes to get myself um out the door meaning from the shower to put in makeup makeup a little makeup on and then doing my hair i usually take about an hour and 15 minutes from the shower to makeup and doing my hair so imagine doing that in 45 minutes all right so i want to show you guys these lips actually i don't know if i'm gonna put all of them on but these are the hermes lipstick samples that i got from bergdorf they came in this little package here that's what the package looked like and it has the names of the colors on but i don't have my glasses on to read them out for you it has a little lipstick applicator that i'll use to apply the lipstick with all right let me open this up and then come back and show you guys which one i'm gonna go with i probably should put on some lip liner first though all right, my favorite lip liner. So no matter what lip color I'm applying, this works. So once I'm done, I'm actually planning on filming a couple of reels. The first one is kind of like a New Year's party theme reel. And that's why I'm wearing my headpiece. This headpiece I wear as a choker. Well, I do the most with this headpiece. I've even worn it as a bracelet. I just make sure I wrap it really tight and I keep it closed by either putting a hair clip or a rubber band and just holding it together. What my lip liner looks like, I like that it's dark but not too dark i really wish you guys were here to tell me which color to use i honestly 
this one definitely no it feels too orange for the look i'm going for i'm going to either go with the deep color right here where my forefinger is or that up here or i might even mix all three together i love to do that so here's the plan i definitely think i want to apply them together three of those colors so they're all like hues of red this is the deepish color one the very dark one so i'll start there and i'll i'm going for our ombre effect So I almost did not need that lip liner since I'm using this on the outer part of my lips. This will almost act like a lip liner. So again, going for that ombre effect. I don't know if I'll be able to use these again after this because I don't know if they will dry out considering that they're opened up. So I may find a place to put them, especially if I like them. All right, so that's the first color. All right, the next color I'm going to use this one here I also have this one I feel like I want to put that one right in the middle so let's go for the next layer I wish I had three of these applicators using a makeup wipe to try to get the excess off so that I can use the most bright color of all so this is what my lips are looking like I already love the two together it's very very winter winter vibes all right but well, let's brighten it up a bit right So I'm using the very bright color and I'm going to just put it in the center of my lips. Now these lips, lipsticks do not feel matte at all. They feel very moisturizing. My lips don't feel cakey. They apply very easily and they're highly pigmented so don't know what these will cost normally but if i can find them i will um, link them below if you're interested in any of these colors my favorite color is the brightest color of course but i think if i put it on by itself it would be really shockingly bright or maybe not i, I don't know What do you guys think? Alright. Lips are done. I usually go for matte, but these are creamy and not matte. Which means they're going to transfer. I prefer not to have a lipstick on that will transfer when I'm eating or drinking or whatever because trust me this will get all over me and I'm gonna look hella crazy <laughs> really really soon <laughs> I'm gonna go try to do some reels guys and I'll show you guys what these looks are that I'll be creating I actually need to film a few pieces that I would have shown you guys in the haul that I didn't get to try on as yet so I'll do this now so you might see some of these things before I mean, so you know act like you've never seen them before okay <laughs> all right let me go do the reels i'll be back guys fam so it is now three or four hours later i managed to shoot this full look that you guys would have seen in a previous video well you didn't see the full look you just kind of got a peek at what it was like and i wanted to shoot a video as well as take some photos didn't take photos but i shot a reel then i shot i think about two or three other looks that i needed to create um just trying to end the 
year with a lot of looks, like a ton of looks, including some photos. So if you aren't following me on Instagram, guys, you are missing out on a lot of the new items that I received. A lot of them are coming to you guys later because I'm taking a lot longer to get these videos uploaded um, and sharing all of those things with you. So if you are interested in all of the things that I might be featuring or styling, then please come over and join the fam on IG as well. All right. So I think I'm going to end the video now. I'll insert those looks for you, those reels. Um, let me know what you think of the styling. I know I can be a little bit out there. I like to think of my style as somewhat avant-garde and um, the way I put my things together because that's really, that's what grabs me. If I see something that is very avant-garde, very different and unique, then I'm there for it. This is actually a hair piece that I've been using, man. Guys, if you see a bit, this is a chain hanging because I hooked it onto the like the ends of the hair piece, and this is only one side. This hair piece has two sides, so this is one side. This chain is actually coming apart because this is what is holding some of the crystals together. Yeah, I've killed this neck, um, this headpiece. I've worn it several ways. I've worn it. This was actually worn for my birthday when I was in Dubai. I wore it as a headpiece uh, when I went to dinner and then since then I've worn it at the, as a headpiece in more than one way because it bends and forms in different shapes and I've worn it as a necklace as well. For me it's all about getting everything out of all the pieces that I have. As you can see the lip colors are still looking very good. I mean I've been away from you guys for about two hours and it still is standing up really really well. I love how it feels on my lips. It's not, it's not heavy but it's very pigmented as I said before and I like the three of them together so I think that's exactly how I'm going to wear them. Don't forget to sum up this video. Give this video a like. Um, subscribe if you have not already. Join the fam. I'm getting closer and closer to my 6,000 mark and I don't know that I'll make it there before the new year but if I do I'll be so happy guys that would be like the best gift ever. I appreciate all of your support and your love, your kind words, I do look forward to your comments so I appreciate you guys so so much. Alright I will see you again tomorrow. Bye guys.